From the students of the Department of Meteorology and Atmospheric Science, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good afternoon, my name is Christian Bowen with your Wednesday afternoon forecast. Starting to take a look at the Penn State golf courses, you can see some cumuliform and some stratus clouds out in the regions. Not a great day for golf though, for those golf lovers. So, moving into the current conditions, it feels like a 59 degrees with a dew point of 54. It is a little dry outside, so that is a reason why some precipitation is not reaching the ground. A visibility of 10 miles with winds out of the west at five miles per hour. Now looking at the temperatures in central Pennsylvania, State College at 59, Du Bois at 58, Johnstown at 54, Harrisburg 62, and Williamsport at 59 degrees. Now expanding out to incorporate the whole Commonwealth, 54 in Erie, 61 in Pittsburgh, 67 in Scranton, which is a high for this region, and 64 in the Philadelphia and Yardley region of Pennsylvania. Looking at the current radar and satellite system moving in through central PA and north central PA with some spotty showers in the back end. Some of this precipitation is not reaching the ground due to a lower dew point and it being pretty dry out. Now, portions of this system, there are some areas of rain that are reaching the ground, but it's mostly north of Williamsport and moving towards Scranton, Pennsylvania. Looking at the whole region, we have a system moving into uh, Dixie Alley which ha is incorporating some chances at some very high severe weather probabilities and a system in Ohio Valley that will reach us tonight and into tomorrow th that will give us a lot of rain. System exiting our region that, is, that I talked about shortly before. Now looking at the precipitation outlook. Today and into m to tomorrow there's an 8% chance of precipitation as do that system in the Ohio Valley reaching Pennsylvania. Chances diminish but are still there for Friday. There are chances at some storms tomorrow for most of the west portions of Pennsylvania. Chances diminish for precipitation on Saturday with only um, early in the morning there will be a greater chance. Sunday chances of precipitation wrap up and Monday they diminish back down to 5%. Now looking at current temperatures across the continental United States, a cold front situated across the central portions of the United States due to there being northwesterly flow air and cold air draping in from Canada, bulging into this region. Now, warmer air in northerly flow, from, so that means winds coming out of the south, providing warm air for regions of southeast Pennsylvania. And then your future weather, this is in t from tonight into tomorrow morning. System goes in, heavy precipitation in the State College in Williamsport area. That will be our highest point where our totals will be. Future, future weather keeps continuing and into Thursday, more chances of showers and thunderstorms, isolated cells. Into Friday, another system comes in, providing us just a small bit of precipitation that day that eventually moves out Saturday morning, ready for a blue and white game. Now, moving on to the rainfall outlook. It, highest chances and biggest areas of precipitation are in the State College and Williamsport region coming in on Thursday. And then another system comes in on Friday that gives us just a little bit boost of precipitation. Now, looking at severe weather outlook for today, a huge moderate risk is placed in Dixie Alley in states such as Louisiana, Mississippi, and Alabama. Tornadoes and severe winds have already been reported and it will continue over the day. Hail is also a major factor in this outlook here. And just there is a very tight gradient in the Louisiana region, and that's due to there being just embedded supercells and a system that's already moved into that area, and there's not much north of it. So moving into the severe other outlook for tomorrow. In Ohio Valley, in cities such as Cincinnati, Columbus, and Pennsylvania, there are a chance for some Severe weather, some spotty showers, but mostly isolated storms in that region will have a chance at, for some heavy winds, hail, and heavy rains. Not a great chance of tornadoes, but there's chances always there. Now in State College, there's a marginal risk with some spotty showers and thunderstorms. Now better portions for severe weather are on the western portions of Pennsylvania. Now if you look towards southeast here in Jacksonville, there is a slight risk, chances of some storms from the ocean. Now looking at tonight in State College, 
A low temperature of 58 degrees with showers overnight. Wind southwest, but calm. Tomorrow, 64 degrees with chances of some rain showers and thunderstorms with winds out of the southeast at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Now, tailgate forecast for Saturday for the blue and white game. Looks picture perfect, other than winds being a factor. Winds will be picking up as the day goes on. Your seven-day forecast. Wednesday, high 67 showers during the day, low 57. Thursday, 64 with some thunderstorms and showers during the day. Overnight, 51. Friday, 55 with some showers, low 41 overnight. Saturday, mostly sunny, but windy during the course of the day, so we have to watch out for that during the blue and white game, low 43. As we continue into Sunday through Tuesday, high temperatures in the upper 60s with mostly cloudy skies, but great conditions for this time of year. From the Penn State Campus Weather Service, I'm Christian Bone. Have a great rest of your day.